sustainability is pretty much part of uh, everything we do because we see it as a business opportunity. It's about creating value both for our customers, for our shareholders, but also uh, for our employees. Sandvik is a, a global uh, engineering company. We are in 150 countries. We have about 43,000 uh, people around the globe. Uh, part of the 17 goals that uh, the UN nation has uh, set up, we have picked out seven which, uh, which are relevant for us, where we think we can make a uh, good impact. So our ambition uh, is to align our targets with the UN uh, uh, Global uh, Sustainability Development Goals. When it comes to automation of underground mining equipment, Sandvik is a global leader. For example, we offer an auto mine uh, underground automated mining system that effectively removes people from the underground environment in certain applications and has them sit on the surface to, to operate the equipment or supervise the equipment. In cases where automation um, is not deployed. We've also taken steps to improve the underground mining environment through developing and implementing battery-powered underground mining equipment. There's effectively zero emissions from the tailpipe of these vehicles, so it drastically improves the working environment underground. So another area where we've uh, innovated with respect to energy and materials efficiency is in our revolutionary new turning method called prime turning. We've seen productivity gains up to 50% where this method is used. Basically, in traditional turning, you cut in one direction, but in prime turning, you're able to cut in two directions, and this drastically improves the productivity. So we've actually taken the method in some of our internal processes, including in our rock drills factory in Tampere as well. I mean, it's, it's a lot about innovation. It's a lot about the digitalization and using uh, these uh, opportunities. And these are areas where uh, Sandvik are already in the forefront and where we also invest a lot of money. Energy efficiency is high on our agenda. And we know that the demand for the chilling of food and air uh, through household appliances like freezers, refrigerators, and air conditioners is on the rise. So we've developed a specialty steel that's used in compressor valves that greatly improves the efficiency of the compressing process up to 50% actually. This is substantial because a large portion of household electricity consumption is actually driven by compressor powered appliances. In order for Sand Lake to implement SDG 12, we have set very ambitious targets to reduce our environmental impact. We focus on reducing the use of water, reducing the use of energy, and also reducing the generation of scrap, and in addition, also reduce the carbon emissions. And also how to regrind, reuse and recycle the products in our production chain. First of all, we can recycle cemented carbide, which is used in the production of cemented carbide. So once a drill or an insert has lost its cutting properties, it can't drill anymore because it's not sharp enough. So it's dangerous to actually damage the material that is being worked on. So then they buy back those tools and then send it to us, and then we completely dissolve these tools and separate the tungsten carbide and the cobalt. And we then recycle the tungsten carbide into a new powder, which can be used for the production of new tools. And the cobalt is sent to one of the biggest producers of cobalt in the world, and they make the cobalt to a reusable product, which means that the whole drill is being recycled and turned back into a new drill. The circle economy is closed. We want to uh, exceed the expectations from our customers, from our shareholders, as well as from our employees. We have to uh, make sure that uh, our objectives and our offerings are sustainable and relevant uh, for the society.